Now let's compare what Linux screen and MMI box have in common and how they differ. First of all, the MMI box does not need to replace the original display. The Linux screen does. The Linux screen is larger than the original screen, with 10.5 versus 12.3 or even larger available. With the MMI box, it is not possible to change the screen size. The Linux screen supports touch functionality. The MMI box cannot support touch functionality. The Linux screen under CarPlay supports calls and music using raw Bluetooth. If raw Bluetooth calls and music are available, and MMI box does not have this feature. Linux screen is simpler to install, whereas with the MMI box, you need to find a place to house it, so the MMI box is slightly more complicated to install but They both have Linux systems, and all their boot up times are comparable. Both products support the original car display function. Again, they both support original and aftermarket camera features. They all support the original nav and steering wheel function key controls. Both products are fairly priced between to five or three hundred USD.